Consider the reaction. N2 plus 3H2 yields 2NH3. How much hydrogen is needed to produce 25.0 grams of NH3? A. 2.22 grams B. 4.44 grams or C. 1.97 grams We are given the amount of ammonia produced is 25.0 grams. By now, you know that if the change in moles of one reactant or product of a reaction is known, we can figure out the changes in the other reactants and products using a conversion factor based on the coefficients in the balanced equation. Therefore, the first thing we need to do is change the information we have from grams to moles. You should know how to do this by now. To convert 25.0 grams of ammonia to moles, we multiply it by one mole ammonia over the molar mass of ammonia, which is 17.03 grams of ammonia. This gives us 1.468 moles. Note that since 25.0 has only three significant figures, this answer should only have three significant digits. But we keep an extra digit since we are going to carry this result over to another calculation. To calculate the amount of hydrogen needed, all we have to do is multiply the moles of ammonia produced by a conversion factor. We use the coefficients in the balanced equation to construct our conversion factor. Since we're interested in hydrogen, we put the coefficient of hydrogen in the numerator The coefficient of hydrogen in the balanced equation is 3. And put the coefficient of ammonia in the denominator. The coefficient of ammonia in the balanced equation is 2. The ratio of coefficients serves as a conversion factor. And the answer we get here is 2.20 moles of H2. But the choices given to us are in grams, so we need to convert our answer to grams. By now, you should know how to do this. We multiply moles of hydrogen by the molar mass of hydrogen. Carrying out the calculation gives an answer of 4.44 grams. Note that we keep three significant digits in our answer since the least precise term in our calculation, 1.468, has only three significant digits. The numbers 3, 2, and 1 in the conversion factors are exact, while the molar mass of hydrogen, 2.016, has four significant dig digits. Therefore, the correct answer is choice B.